Tom Isaiah with Wood, Brass and Glass and today I'm going to be talking about having issues and problems and some possible solutions for why the convertible top won't work for my 2012 Mitsubishi Eclipse Spider. Stay tuned. Okay, so for starters, uh, go ahead and release the tabs, pop them, and this is what happens normally is you just push the on off button, the open close, open, and your top begins to open, it does its thing, opens up, lets the sunlight in, closes, it's normal, okay, sometimes people don't have that, it doesn't do that normal, but for me, it, it did. Then I went to close it. It closed and closed and closed and stopped right here. And it was starting to rain. I'm like, holy smoke, what am I supposed to do? It's a hydraulic system. So I didn't panic. So through calls and lots of internet searches, this is what I discovered. Back underneath the top. All right, they'll say this, you know, caution, manual operation only, don't open it except for emergency. Well, this is an emergency. Here's the hydraulic reservoir system, pressurization, pressurization, uh, tubings and stuff, and electronic controls. This is the release valve for the hydraulic fluid. You turn this with some pliers, uh, big pliers, preferably mine was, it was really torqued down. Let's turn it counterclockwise to release the, the pressure on the on these hydraulic and there's one over there and then there's one here I will release the tension on this and that and you can close this guy down close that one down now we'll have to say that since the pressure is released it's just kind of holding there by its own weight but I was able to drive this car up to 70 miles an hour uh, down to the dealer and he didn't have any answers either <laughs> so it was kind of annoying, but he did make some pointers uh, that helped. So I'm gonna close this up. That's what it's supposed to do. And then chime. So one of the things he pointed out, which I had no idea on, was this. This is the back seat panel box. Get your fingers in there, pull it out. Now. Right there is where our tool goes, and that tool is right here. In the back, back, bulk, in the bulk of the speaker panel. Now, it takes a little prying, but it's basically a gigantic Allen wrench with some cushions, so it will help your fingers. So, what you can do, it will lock the black, I'm sorry, it'll lock the red body panel down this section will be over here what you do is just spin it and it rotates around it locks down it's basically just a lock and uh, your system will do that electronically see if I go to push this to open it'll open it by itself watch there it goes see all right let's close locked cool now check this out. What's this little key thing for? That is for your back trunk. Yeah, that's for your back trunk. So it, I guess it's an emergency release of some sort if you can't get it uh, to open up. Here's another tip that unrelated to the back or the convertible top. Your back trunk, push unlock twice, and it will unlock your back trunk. Because uh, it is only a push button switch. Now, the back trunk is unlocked. You can get into it free. All right, so I just wanted to add one last tidbit to this video. And that is the auxiliary mic input. So what you do? Here's the CD button. Push and hold it. And what does that say? That says auxiliary. Now where is that darn plug? 
from what I've seen lately is that uh, most people are known have really found this plug on maybe the older models. This is a 2012, so maybe the manufacturer added it. And where is that plug? No, 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 okay. That plug is in here. There's the plug. That little square box with a tab. That's the 3.5 millimeter plug. You plug it in there, and what I did was use a Bluetooth module that plugs right into the 12 volt slot. Power outlet, plug it in, and pair this whole thing with your phone. Now, I don't have uh, a link to this one. I bought this many years ago, so it's just a cheapo from China. It only costs like five bucks. But it's lasted for years and years. And uh, you can pair it to your phone, watch, listen to all your tunes, and it works great, it's been working great. So, there is the mystery of the mic input. Right there. No one is more happier to have this top working than the cat. Well, that's it for this video. Uh, if you have, if this made any help, gave any help for you, uh, please make a mention in the comments or have any questions I might be able to answer for you. Click that like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos, and I'll be doing more stuff for this car as uh, repairs come in. And I'll see you guys on the next one while I enjoy this sun. I guess I should put my seatbelt on. <laughs> Driving that seatbelt. Mm -mm. Oh yeah. See you on the next one.